The fifth race is the final race of the day for the older horses, and it's a nine furlong race. And the top one is ninth Ollie for Darren Thompson, Garen Society for David Robertson, Evil in Veins, Michael Scala, Judge Dread, Paul O'Neill, Givry Magique for Alex Cherry, Brosnan Hawk, CJJ Liggett, Lifeguard Emma, and Sweet Surrender for. Craig Allen, Sales Pitch for Leon Van Rensburg, Pale Blossom for Martin Lidham, Provencher List for Graham Clutterbuck, King of Arms, Ryan Costello, Fresno Warning, Vinnie Gerard, and Major Trickster, David Hooley. So 14 this time, then. And in the rain, and away they go. And the grey ninth Holly is the first one to show. And they've been immediately challenged by King of Arms. Now on this near side is Garrett Society. They're quite well spread across the track, but it's a straight track room, so no need to worry. But they're going to. It looks like they're going to spread into two groups, which might make my life a little bit more difficult. But down on this near side, ninth Holly, the grey, is the clear leader, and he's ahead of Major Trickster in the purple. Then the green and the. Uh, yellow stripes down the hoops down this near side is lifeguard Emma and um, behind that one is Garrett Society and then the back mark on this near side I think is Provence Share List right over on the far side major uh, sales pitch is just about in front but now being headed by Sweet Surrender so it's definitely ninth Ollie who's got the lead and as they race into the final five and a half furlongs and ninth Ollie is in front down on this near side from over on the far rail Sweet Surrender lifeguard Emma there's a second grey over there as well now pale blossom that I hadn't noticed before which is a bit stupid because it's mine then comes Givery Magic and Judge Dread, King of Arms and Fresno Warning after that one. But towards the back, Brosna Hawk is just about the back I can see. If you look at the graphic and then you look at the angle, it would appear, wouldn't it, that Evil in Veins is the back marker, and that's why sometimes it's difficult to tell what's win and what's won and what's in the lead. But it's ninth Ollie who is in the lead, and it's clear by, I would say, a good two or three lengths to in second place. Lifeguard Emma Sweet Surrender over on the far rail shells bit. Then comes uh, Pale Blossom after that one. Garrett Society down on this near side is trying to get into it as well, but it's ninth Ollie who's still clear as they pass the two furlong pole. Ninth Ollie then leading by about two lengths to Sweet Surrender in sales bit. Lifeguard Emma, Garrett Society, Pale Blossom, but they're well, well strong out in this one as they pass the floor on pole ninth Ollie being pushed along but he's still too clear of Sweet Surrender and Sales Pitch it looks like in between these three although Garen Society and Life Gone Emma are trying to run on now all of a sudden the far side has it and it's Sweet Surrender and Ninth Pitch who are bursting clear and Sweet Surrender wins it from Ninth Pitch in second and then Garen Society and what a messy race that was from my point of view as they were spread across the track with double handed trainers with the same colours on both sides of the track as well so it's Sweet Surrender that's taken it from sales pitch and Garrett society well that's what I called home or not I really couldn't say but <laughs> it's another one for Craig Allen sweet Allen for sweet surrender for Craig Allen is the winner sales pitch for Leon van Rensburg second and Garrett society Dave Rawson third ninth Ollie for Darren Thompson who was a long time leader in fourth and lifeguard Emma for Craig Allen was fifth